second guy comes up. Okay? Now, I'm getting really tired of this fucking radio. Okay. okay. <coughs> uh, what else? When you bound, if you can, find cover. If you can't, oh well. But if you can, find cover. Another key thing. Do not cross the line of fire of anybody firing. Because, you know, that's my not work so good. Uh, the other thing is, communication is very important. In a move and fire exercise, stealth is not a concern anymore. It's the theory being that they already know you're there. So when you're moving, when you go to move, you say move. When you go to fire, you say fire. If you need to reload, you say loading. Can you guys do a demo now for gold? Let's start up at the bench. why you don't want to get rid of your mouth and you can't <laughs> fucking find it. Where are with you? That's what I was waiting for, but as soon as you guys started shooting, I just made you. That's my fault. <laughs> Dents in the metal. That depends on which game. It depends on the scenario, but yeah, you can some some games you play you, you basically wait two minutes to respawn. Like for two minutes before you bleed out and then you can just call yourself out and go respawn. Although it real that's actually highly dependent on the game. Even the CCP, it's the way we're using it right now. So 
Actually, I just gotta find out if, uh, if we can move forward. If you guys decide to come out to West Can, the general rule from what I've read for the new series as well as for the old ones, uh, you wait 10 minutes and or until five people come back to base to respawn. Then either the five of you or alone can go out after 10 minutes. Yay! This. That is highly dependable. I think or dependent. I think at one point I had set it to that for my game, but to be honest, that's usually up to the guy. You basically, whenever you're getting ready for an op, make damn sure you go and you read everything. Yeah, like we do have a fairly standard rule set, but we're constantly enhancing. Like at one point, you could actually, even if you were respawning, you could defend the CCT, but we found that that was just uh, too ridiculous. So, because like the theory being that you could, re you could defend the CCT as an injured person. As soon as you got hit again, though, you'd have to then go back to your main base and respawn. But we decided to get rid of that. It got to be a little. Like, and a lot of games, for instance, I know the next game, rolling up CCTs, which is, you know, picking up another team CCT, actually gets you hurt. So, it's not a bad deal. Like, objectives get you points, rolling up CCTs get you points. Various things. You guys didn't duck like you wanted to see. 